A lot of people ask me, what is Invisalign? If the dentist tells them they're going to need ortho, they're going to need braces, they then ask me, well, can I just have Invisalign, that clear retainer that people put in and it makes their teeth straighter? So let me explain what Invisalign is to you and why it may or may not be the best option. So let me show you guys a photo first. So this is what Invisalign looks like. What it is, you get a series of clear retainers and they're going to change every month, even maybe twice a month, depending on what your schedule is. It depends on how bad your teeth are starting off with. If there's a lot of spaces that need to be filled in, if your teeth need to be shifted a lot, then it might take two years of Invisalign changing the trays every month. It's hard to say. Your dentist or your, or your orthodontist can tell you a lot more. But what Invisalign is, is you're going to be wearing these trays, these retainers all day, every day. You take them out for eating, that's it because these are slowly moving your teeth to the position where you want them to be. And once the teeth start moving, well then those retainers aren't going to fit anymore. So then they need to order you new ones. You go pick them up and then you have new retainers. Once the teeth shift and move even more, then guess what? You need new ones. So that's how Invisalign works. It's not typically cheaper than your um, regular orthodontic treatment. It's not even more expensive. It's usually about the same. So if you're thinking about Invisalign to save money, it's probably going to be the same cost anyway. But it really does depend on how your teeth are starting out with. I can't give you the exact cost. It could be $6,000. It could be $8,000. It could be less or it could be more. So please talk to your dentist about that. And then, so this is what the retainers look like when, oh, sorry guys, let's go back here, when they're inside the mouth. So they are clear. And believe it or not, people can't tell unless they're like looking at your teeth, they're like watching you, they won't be able to tell you have them in. That's the nice thing about Invisalign. They are clear, but you have to be dedicated. You have to always have them in, only take them out when eating. If you say to yourself, oh, I'm just gonna wear them a couple hours a day, your teeth aren't going to shift. Believe me, I wish it was that easy, but it's not. So you have to be dedicated to wear them all day, every day, only take them out when eating and then put them right back in. So this is just a little example for you of Invisalign is meant to correct mistakes that honestly aren't that bad. Now, I look at this picture and this patient, this person looks like they have an overbite. Typically overbite, or sorry, open bites, open bites. This person is biting down, but notice how there's a space here. It should look like this. This is the after photo. Um, I'm guessing this person did need some orthodontic treatment. So not just Invisalign. Invisalign can't change how you bite down. What Invisalign does is it's going to cor um, correct spaces or correct very small tips or rotations. So if you're looking inside your mouth right now and you're saying to yourself, ooh, I have a lot of crowding, there's a lot of tips, a lot of rotations, I have spaces, I can't bite down all the way. <laughs> That's an extreme example, but Invisalign probably won't work for you. But I don't know, you have to be checked out by the dentist and they will let you know. Not all dentists, not all um, orthodontic specialists do Invisalign. So check with your dentist first. If you are a good candidate for Invisalign, they might say no, and then the journey stops there because you might need more. You might need different orthodontic treatment to really change your mouth first. Your palate might be too small. So your palate needs to be adjusted to make it bigger. Invisalign does not do that. Invisalign is for the teeth only. Very small mistakes need to be corrected. So please talk to your dentist and they will let you know. I hope this helped you guys. Comment below if any questions and I will talk to you guys in the next one.